Sunday the 10th of April. Back underneath uh, the boardwalk for another day of picking. Um, coming out a little later today, it's the afternoon, not the morning as I usually do because the weather, the weather's been atrocious the last couple of days. Uh, we've seen hail, wind, rain. We had a dusting of snow last night. Um, it's just been crazy, uh, wind and rain it's completely soaked down here again it had dried out a little bit last week but there's water down in the lower parts of this again and uh, we'll just I'm gonna be fighting the mud today I'm gonna be fighting you know wet stuff that wants to stick instead of just release from the picker but I did a bunch of work on on trash mob this morning and thought hey the weather is kind of broken for a bit I'll get out there and do some picking so it's not a complete loss of a weekend there but I'm gonna continue on from where I left off on Thursday night and just keep going, clean up a couple more areas here and see if I can't get down towards the, the where I picked a couple weeks ago and just kind of link that up and feel good to get that done. So we'll get started on that now and I'll uh, put the camera for some time lapse and hopefully enjoy it. I'll catch you in a little while. cleaned up a couple of areas area one back to the back back there and then area two over my shoulder here and now we start in on the next big camp here um I'm gonna, like i said stay to the top side here um i didn't realize that this was the home of 
the famous Washington State Siberian Tiger. Just so I have to be careful of him. This is his home, I guess. And it's also the home of very low beams now, so I'm back to squatting down. But as you can see, I only got two spots left till I get up to where I cleaned last or previously. So I'm gonna get the headway. It's starting to start to look like stuff is getting done. Um, so yeah, I'll just keep going down this uh, left side here, and I'm gonna have a lot of blankets and garments by the looks of it here. There's just a lot of stuff on the ground, so. Clean up the center and and work my way up. There's not too much stuff up in there because there's just a lot of blackberries. So people can't throw stuff where they can't get to. So a little bit more farther down there, just off the side. But this this will be the worst pile in here once we get to that. So but hey, we're getting somewhere with this stuff. So uh, yeah, set up the camera a little farther down. Check the battery. Battery's good for now. And keep going. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six and a half bags today. A lot of them are blankets and clothes and stuff like that. And a whole bucket of socks. Uh, wet socks I found down here. Um, but I finished up that side all the way up to where I've been picking before. Uh, I'm sure it'll need a second pick. I can already see stuff that I missed, but gotta get up in the bushes there later. But next time I come down here, we start on this side from wherever it makes sense, probably back at the start there and just work my way forward again and uh yeah uh it's, it's coming along it's getting dark um i don't know if you saw it on the time lapse but we had a hailstorm roll through and uh yeah it was weird to hear it hitting the wood above you 